our challenges are the same. This is not the first time. You know, ups and downs always come. Whenever Allah sends somebody, He sees that the world is not going on the right path. There's some up and um, there's a, some some upset in the system. And all the prophets who came, they came in this that situation. So, the founder of the Ahmadiyya movement, whom we claim as the Prophet Muhammad Islam and Madhi Islam, came. So, our challenges are the same because now, because of not only because of uh, uh, lack of religious guidance, but because of economic crisis and the involvement of the media and electronic media in changing the minds of the people and so many other factors. The, the world, the most part of the world is now trying to leave the religion or even to the extent they try to, they, they are quite a number of them are and, and, and the, the number of them hate the religion. This is why in my yesterday's address, I said, people are fed up now from the religion. So the challenge is now that we shall have to bring, to make the people realize that religion is not the cause of all this disturbance. There are so many other factors that we have to consider. If we go and see the true and real teachings of the religion, None of the religion has ever asked and forced their people to commit brutalities, to, to usurp the rights of others, right? So, we have the challenge, apart from the preaching, the giving the true teaching of Islam, we have to make the world realize that if they want to, their world to live long, and to, if they want themselves to live in a peaceful way, then they will have to change their attitude and never ever say ill words or filthy words against the founders of the religions or any other religion or never blame the religion.